Assalamu alaikum my dear students this is Ifla Muzaffar your biology teacher from SRM Welkin Higher Secondary School Sopor Today we are going to learn about photosynthesis All living things require food humans and animals eat other animals or plants as food but plants cannot eat like humans or animals Plants obtain food by preparing it on their own by the process called photosynthesis. Only green plants carry out photosynthesis. The word photosynthesis is made up of two words, photo and synthesis. Photo means light and synthesis means making or putting together. During the photosynthesis the leaves trap sunlight and use it to make sugar molecules like starch the light energy is changed into chemical energy which is stored in the starch molecules To carry out photosynthesis plants require four things light energy chlorophyll carbon dioxide and water Photosynthesis begins with the light striking the leaves of plants. Both sunlight and artificial light such as from lamps and are suitable for photosynthesis. Chlorophyll is the green pigment found in chloroplasts present in the cells of leaves. The chloroplasts absorb and store the energy from the light. The stored energy is then further utilized in the process of food manufacture. Carbon dioxide and water serve as the raw materials for photosynthesis. Plants absorb carbon dioxide from the air. The carbon dioxide enters into the plant through pores called stomata present on the surfaces of their leaves. From the stomata, the carbon dioxide travels to the chloroplasts, where it combines with the water to form glucose. The combining of carbon dioxide and water utilizes the energy stored into the chloroplast. Plants absorb water from the surrounding soil with the help of root hairs present on their roots. Water absorbed by the roots is then transported to the leaves through the stem. So the equation for the photosynthesis is carbon dioxide plus water in presence of sunlight and chlorophyll gives us carbohydrate plus oxygen. The glucose produced during photosynthesis is carried through special tubes phloem to different parts of the plant now which is the site of photosynthesis primary site is the leaf yes undoubtedly the leaf remember all green parts of the plant are capable of photosynthesis you have learned earlier about plastids the double membraned organelles found only in the plant cells Chloroplasts are the plastids that have chlorophyll and are vital for the manufacture of food. Each chloroplast consists of two parts, the grana which are piles of flattened sac-like bodies and the stroma, a liquid matrix. The flattened sac-like bodies are called thylakoids. The thylakoid membrane consists of protein complexes that have chlorophyll and it is here that the photosynthetic reactions occur. Thank you. I hope you have understood the topic very well.